Hey guys. So tonight we're doing the cornbread and chili um, that we were supposed to do the other night. But we stopped about 20 minutes ago, 25 minutes ago, so James could take a potty break and he asked if I want to go ahead and get the cornbread started. So this is the cornbread we bought. It was just under a dollar, I think. And it's just add water. And with stomach issues with milk and then you know, having to add eggs and things like that, I figured this would be perfect. Um, we haven't tried this brand that I can recall, so I'm excited to see how it tastes. Even though it is a buttermilk cornbread, I think I'll be okay. So, anyway. So I came back to check on it while James was fueling, and I tried the, um, you can hear beeping, I tried the paper towel method that Lorinda Tejada had suggested, shout out to Lorinda, and I put two paper towels in, I don't know how well you can see, but they are damp, um, and so I came to check, and it looks beautiful, let's see if I can close up, it's not shiny and doughy looking, the edges are kind of pulling apart already, and I mixed it in here so it doesn't look so pretty, it looks kind of crusty, but I mixed it in the bowl, or the pot, so again, I wouldn't have to waste a bowl, and it just beeped, I did white rice setting so it went a full cycle and it's done I mean this you guys can't really tell because of the camera I have a light on but the color is actually golden brown or well golden yellow I guess for cornbread the bottom I'm sure is golden brown but it's not doughy it's not sticky so again if you're doing things like this and you haven't before you've seen the light now use paper towels to prevent uh, the tops of your baked items from becoming soggy and damp. So we're pulling into a parking spot now. I'm going to go ahead and get the chili cooked. We'll cut this up and I'll post a photo or another video with that. Thank you guys very much. 